What is going on guys? Tanner Pfeiffer here with Pfeiffer Football, NFL broadcaster on YouTube, Tanner Pfeiffer NFL on Twitter. Guys, go ahead and follow me on Instagram, 60,000 followers on there, um, Pfeiffer Football on there. Guys, we're going to be talking about Odell Beckham Jr. and the real reason he did not sign with the New York Jets after there was reports saying he was on his way to New York to meet with the uh, New York Jets brass. They were going to sit down and talk about his potential role on the offense, him and Aaron Rodgers and the synergy and contract details and uh, do his physical as well. But Baltimore <laughs> signed Odell Beckham Jr. to a one-year $18 million deal. Well, it's up to $18 million. The real reason he did not sign with the Jets is because they were not going to offer him up to $18 million. I don't see any team right now crazy enough to have offered him this. I didn't know Baltimore was going to offer him this much. It's kind of insane. Uh, I think he has, what, 13 or 15 mil guaranteed with incentives up to 18 mil. So I want to say he had like a $1 million salary, but a $13 million signing bonus. And then the rest is based on incentives on how well he plays. Him and Lamar Jackson are going to be together. He's going to be the true wide receiver one um, with Lamar Jackson. I don't know how this is going to go. It's not a pass first offense, but there was reports by Jordan Schultz that uh, Lamar Jackson has been actively recruiting, has actively been recruiting OBJ all offseason. There was reports like earlier in the offseason that it was possible OBJ was going to go to the Ravens. But in the last few weeks, guys, it seemed like the Jets were going to sign him all the way, either that or back to the New York Giants. But in reality, oh my gosh, the real reason he didn't sign was because nobody else but the Ravens were crazy enough to offer him up to $18 million. 31 years old, I think, coming off a second torn ACL. Lamar Jackson, OBJ, killing it together.